Everyone's in position for immunity. And now we have a showdown between Sean and Nina, the smallest in the tribe, taking on the biggest. Oh. But that is it. Sean drops, and Nina wins her first individual immunity. 16th person voted out of Heroes versus Villains, fourth member of our jury, Sean. Sean Hampson joins us now. We couldn't get rid of Hughes. He wanted to stick around. I know he's a Carlton man from way back. Yeah, yeah. Sean, former champion AFL footballer. Before on. we talk well, football, well, no, no, hang on. I'm uh, not going to. Oh, all right, fine. Let's talk. Let's talk the show first. <laughs> um, you were so close to winning that challenge. When did you know? What was the moment you knew it was over? Um, it was about 12 minutes, which doesn't seem long, but in that challenge, like, I, I couldn't stand for five minutes afterwards. And there was one point where, like, I was shaking, like, it, it looked horrible. And I looked over at Nina and she just sort of had this blank look on her face. And I was like, she's going oh, all man. day here. And I just went till I had nothing left in the tank and, and dropped. And as you can see, well, I, was, I was heartbroken because I knew that I was a big chance of going home that night. Oh. As in, if you didn't win that challenge, that yeah, was going to exactly. be exactly. I, I yeah. sort of, it was a must win and... Couldn't win it. <laughs> um, now, looking at the show, what's still to come, can anyone take George down? Like, if you couldn't, a chiselled god like yourself couldn't take him down. How did, can anyone do it? He's very good, huh? He's very yeah. good. He was on last we night. We had him last well. night, yeah. The I was out with eye. him for a few drinks beforehand, too, so he came here with, like, three vodka martinis deep. Did so he? I was glad that he was coherent. <laughs> yeah. um, but he's, he's just very good. I don't think the game's seen a strategist like him. Mm. Um, his social game leaves a little bit to be desired, but oh, right. he's, he's going to take some stopping, that's for sure. Yeah. Well, you know whether he's won or not, though, don't you? So well, this I is know, real... to pretend. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've got the moment that you headed home to your beautiful family. What oh. was it like? to see them again. Yeah, it's, it's incredible. I mean, if you've been in a similar situation like that, not necessarily eight weeks, and I can't look at it, hey. <laughs> it's, um, it's really, it's, it's special, like you can see it there. I was, I was so wrapped that they filmed it because we didn't film it last time. Um, and there's, there's really nothing like it, like how they look to you after that time and not seeing them, because we don't, we genuinely don't get anything. <laughs> like, not a how are they going or anything, so. Wow. It's incredible, yeah. And, and that's a genuine reaction, you know. I mean, you, you, you can't, you can't, you know, you can't force them to do that. I mean, when I get home, I, when I get home, my kids, my kids don't even look up from their iPads. <laughs> well, that's what it's like at home now. So I, that, that was nice as a bit of a one-off. But can we go back to the footy stuff? There we go. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Why did you say he loves you because he's a Carlton man? You're a Richmond man. I'm a bit split, hey. No, no, no you're not no, split. No, no. Don't no. do this to Ali. No, no, I was, I was, I, I finished at Richmond. I was always Richmond from when I finished football. I knew all the guys. Yes. I've been doing some stuff with Carlton's AFLW team yeah. and it sort of started pulling no, me no, back a little bit. No, you can't go back. Mate, Carlton were your, fir your first love, all right? So, and I believe that they're your long-term love, you know? Them, wow. Them and, you know, if you had to choose between them and Megan, you'd probably choose Carlton, wouldn't you? And so. <laughs> yeah, fair. <laughs> Surely when you left Carlton to go to Richmond, you knew you were trading up. That was the plan. Yes! <laughs> um, that was the plan, and, you know, it, it actually worked. Got close to a premiership, yeah. just missed out on that 2017 team, so... Um, I was about as successful at Richmond as I was at Carlton, so it didn't really <laughs> no, work. Right. Yeah. All right, let's settle this with the war seat, you guys. What do you think? <laughs> um, we recently had your stunning partner, uh, uh, fiance, um, Megan, Megan Gale, on the show, and she showed us... You're a bit cheeky to her at home. Let's have a look at a video that she showed us. What the f***? <laughs> 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 oh, don't f*** you doing that, you idiot. <laughs> 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 How do you think she'd go on the island, you meanie? If people were scaring her, no good. But <laughs> otherwise, I think she'd be very good, but I, I can't help it. Scaring her is my favourite thing to do on Why? her. Why? You've seen the her. Reaction. How good is it? Does she, let, does she let you post things without, like, you can just post it, or she goes, you know... Oh, like... that took a little bit of convincing. But she actually clocked me with her bottle. She almost cut me open oh, on oh, that last one. But it was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> it was worth it. <laughs> I'll do it again. So Thanks for your time. That's, That's a pleasure. <laughs>